It's on low, medium. We're gonna grab one stick, two sticks of butter, and then one cup of packed brown sugar. Perfect. Now we're gonna let that all melt and get it boiling. All right, it's starting to melt. You wanna just keep stirring it consistently and let it get to a boil. All right, so it's getting that nice boil. This is what you want it to look like. We're gonna keep stirring it for a little bit longer and then it's gonna go on top of those yummy pretzels. Okay. Ooh, this is gonna be so delicious. This is a family favorite around Christmas time. Look at that yummy caramel. Yep, homemade caramel, the good stuff. Okay, that looks perfect. I'm gonna turn off my stove and then let's go ahead, bring it to those pretzels. And then we're gonna drizzle it on top of those pretzels, just like this. It's okay if it's not perfect because it's just gonna expand and become perfect in the oven. Perfect. Okay. Pop this in the oven. It's set to 325 and it's just gonna be eight minutes in the oven. See, I told you it would expand. Now all the pretzels are fully covered. Go ahead and slide it on your counter. Perfect. Now while it's hot, you're gonna wanna grab some chocolate chips. You can use dark chocolate. You can even use white chocolate, but I'm just doing the milk chocolate, semi-sweet. And just sprinkle it right on top of that caramel and that pretzels. Mmm. Get a good serving on there. Okay, perfect. So we use about three fourths of a bag. And now we're gonna go ahead and pop this back in the oven for just one minute to let those chocolate chips melt. Okay, it's in there for one minute. Now go ahead and grab your spatula. I'm gonna just spray it just a little bit so it doesn't get too sticky. Just kind of boop, 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 boop. And then we're gonna spread that chocolate right over just like that. Yummy. Mmm. Okay. Now to make it extra pretty and extra festive, I'm gonna grab my Christmas sprinkles now this is totally optional, but I want mine to be super pretty. So just go ham with your Christmas sprinkles. Mm, I'm so excited for this. Okay. All over the whole pan. All right, that is so cute. Now we're gonna go ahead and pop this in the fridge for 30 minutes, and then we have the best Christmas candy you could ask for. Okay, it's all ready. I already removed our foil, so this baby is ready. Okay, we can just break pieces off. Oh, that caramel is just chewy and delicious. Just like that, get your little pieces of candy ready for your holiday parties. So we have our beautiful Christmas candy. Let's go ahead and grab a piece. Ooh, I'm so excited. That is incredible. 